All right, going to be taking a look at stock ticker symbol VGID. Uh, the last time that we took a look at this one was going to be on March 3rd. That's going to put us about right here. Uh, as far as that goes, 0006 needs more volume, and it will move, in my opinion. Resistance at 0007, support at 0005 and 4. Chart is set up, in my opinion. Technical analysis alert, uh, and Jobum was the one that brought brought us to us. So, it, it, like I said, it, it's been... Uh, a week now since we've looked at this stock, just trying to get through them. Um, you guys are making a move today up to triple zero. I'm sorry, double zero eleven. Uh, I'm going to be completely honest. The only thing I'm a little uh, concerned with is that gap. I'm going to mark that down. Um, I mean, that gap, I, I, I personally don't like them um, because they do have an influence on the stocks. My personal opinion, I'm going to put that down there. I'm going to watch for that. It has a potential, but I, I would watch for that gap to fill before it really moves, um, my personal opinion. I, I like the stock. I like the way that it's set up. Uh, I'm just not 100% comfortable with that gap right now. That's, I mean, I'm not going to BS around, beat the bush. All right, so I'll go ahead and type this up, Joe. Was there anything recent on this one? Mm, let's see. One second. I don't see any recent news. It's February 2nd, and then I was just going over to see if there's any filings. Because right now they're pink limited. One second. What day was the last time we went over? Uh, the was that third. with me? Yes. Okay. Well, I mean, not since the last time. I mean, they have their annual report for the year end 2016, but I mean, we obviously went over it once, right? I'm guessing, well, like the last time we went over it. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty much that. Um, I mean, obviously, if you want to research this company more, you go right over to the VGID board. You pull up their uh, their filings, and you go into that that latest uh, annual report that came up. Because I mean, that's basically where you're going to find everything you could possibly need to uh, you know make a decision on where this thing's possibly going. And obviously, you look at their uh, their recent news. I know the the February second news was their uh, Fernhill Beverages Incorporated announces FINRA approval corporate action. I'm not sure what the corporate action is. I'll pull it up real quick. All right, so they did uh, the payment is a 10 to 1 for every 10 shares of VGID, an eligible VG group shareholder. Had on the record date, they will receive one share of Fernhill Beverage. All right. So, I mean, that, that was going on last month. So, obviously, this thing's going on with them. So as always, if you have an opinion on the company, go right over to that VGID board and share it with the uh, tens of thousands of like-minded investors that are using the site daily by posting right up over, uh, over there on that message board. All right, as far as the chart goes, 0010 starting to move now, but there is a gap at 0009 and 8. Resistance at 001 and 12 support at 0008. Uh, I would watch for that gap, my personal opinion, guys. That's all. Uh, I mean, it could definitely explode from here. Uh, it could. I mean, I'm, I, anything's possible, but I would watch for that gap to fill. VGID, if you follow the stock, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. We would appreciate that very much. Get out there and share this video with all other investors. That would be awesome. And if you have a hot stock other than VGID, head over to investorshangout.com forward slash live and let us know. We'll be sure to take your hot stock and add it to the list.